Well, good morning, everybody. Welcome back to Body Pal Picking. I am headed out to do some yard sales this Saturday morning. It is 7.42 a.m. There's one specifically I want to head up because uh, it's a friend of mine who had sent me a uh, specifically sent me a flyer. I didn't see it anywhere. She just sent it to me. There's going to be a couple of different families. She said at least two. This is the lady who sold me a Sega Dreamcast in the past and some sealed video games. And I had a really good deal on all that. So hoping to make some more profit for eBay today. Let's see what I find. Y'all hold on tight. Ready for the ride. Good morning. Good morning. Y'all doing all right? Oh, there, there you are. <laughs> yeah. How are you? Good. Whew. Let's see what you got, right? Of course. Right. What are you doing over? I work at the ASC building where I hand out hardware so everybody can work from home. I got you. <laughs> Everybody's got to work from home, right? That'd be nice. I'm trying to figure out how to do that myself. <laughs> All right, I know that these beer tap handles could be good money but each one of them must have been out in a garage or something but the screw on bottom has dirt uh, from like a dirt dopper or something like that Keep change. What? <laughs> what you do, rob banks or? <sighs> this office game i saw it and i recently sold an office monopoly for big money like a hundred bucks and i thought this might be good as well <laughs> So I'm double checking that all the parts and pieces are inside. It's complete, but parts have been taken out of the cardboard and things of that nature. But it, again, it is complete. Yeah, I'll give you the four you're asking for this. You keep the one dollar because you told me about it so early. Appreciate it. I don't see much of anything else. This isn't Bulldogs, is it? Yep, it is. Who's the signature? I, I can't tell. But that is a real signature, and it's yep. old. You're welcome to... I have no idea who it could be, though. Zoom in. Zoom in, whatever I'm trying to say. I know what you're trying to say. I don't... The Bulldogs are winning. <clears throat> They're doing good this year. Where was the psycho Rolex? Oh, it's, sure. it's right here. It's not a Rolex. It's a psycho. Yeah. Um, there's a couple of nice watches if they're interested. That's okay. My mama always taught me to look for the pearls. Um, <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh. Jock. <laughs> Jock. Like, Jack Peterson. The only explanation was, well, Jack and Kenny said pearls go with everything. <laughs> hey, puppy. Hey, puppy. Hey, puppy. You're so cute. He's a fat. I'm an Alabama. He's a little pug. Pugs are supposed to be fat. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'll see you later, Christy. Thanks for letting me know. Yeah. Well, unfortunately, there wasn't much there. It was a bunch of ladies' clothes, mostly, and some home decor. I did go ahead and pick up that The Office trivia game. I gave her five bucks for it. They were asking four, but I gave her the extra buck because she is a friend, and she reached out to me, and she sent me the message, and she calls on me a couple of times. And I mean, not every time it's a great thing, but like this time, but last time, I'll tell you what, it was a great deal. So I just want to keep that relationship alive. Ultimately, I think that office trivia game, I might can pull 15 plus shipping. I did see one listing pre-owned for $25 plus shipping. And I think it's all in the display, the way you display the games. I'm headed to another estate sale and it's, uh, I'm headed to an estate sale that I saw on the map. And uh, I'm not sure what to expect there, but they had Christmas decor. I'm always looking for ceramic Christmas trees. Let's see what's next. <laughs> mm hmm. Now, where is Lamon? It's just right there on the left. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Is there another one? I, uh -huh. There's another estate sale? Or there's another yeah. yard sale? What? Okay. Yeah. Hey, good morning. You got stuff inside and outside, y'all. Good morning. Hey, good morning. Y'all doing all right? Yeah, how are you? Good morning. Doing great. 
thank you. We have stuff in the, open the cabinets. Okay. Open. <laughs> open, open. Thank you, admit it. Okay. Brenda. Yes, ma'am. Come here. I think I found you something. I think I found you something. At least I found some possibilities. It was a pretty picked over estate sale. Not many things to really call my own. Um, got this Phillips VHS cleaner for myself for the resale business when I get VCRs. And I got this uh, bed sheet uh, for my son who likes to build forts and then he's having a fort building birthday party. But these are pretty darn good. So I got this Kodak 35 millimeter camera for $3. It's only about $15 to $20. And then I got this Olympus Infinity Zoom 105 35 millimeter camera for $5. And it's the home run. It's around $70, $80. And I even saw one listed for around $130 right there. Actually, that's sold, not listed. That's sold. So I'm going to obviously take it home and get it. Uh, test it as best I possibly can but this is the home run out of, on my way out of this community there was another yard sale sign I had missed earlier because I was paying attention to my maps and so I'm gonna I had to go all the way out and then come all the way back in because it was literally three doors down from it on a different street so I'm gonna head on into this yard sale and see what they got cross your fingers good morning hey, how you doing? I'm great how are you doing That's difficult right now. <laughs> Thank you, sweetie. Thank you. Look at that. Real cheap. Real cheap. Real cheap. Real cheap. Is it all parts and pieces? Yeah. No, it's all good. You can get up and down. I don't want to see. I got to look at some I grew up hunting in a stand like that. I saw that. <laughs> those uh, those uh, jackets are all pretty good size, you know. Mm-hmm. Uh, it's a nice jacket. Yeah, it's a big one. <laughs> yeah, it's a big one. Roger's a uh, usually a two X. Mm-hmm. Tall. <laughs> Did you have set prices or anything? Uh, well, we'll take five for each. Okay. What about for this radio right here? Uh, I think, what do you think for the radio? Eight CD player, rather. Eight bucks. Eight bucks. Eight bucks. Yeah. What are you giving me for that stair stand? It's complete. Um. I don't know. I don't. I'm, I mean, I, I didn't expect to find a deer stand while I was out today. <laughs> I'll be honest with you. Hello. She gets Tula. You sure? Tula. Yeah, she gets no. I'll give you something for it then. You too. I've got twenties left in my pocket because I spent the small stuff. What if I gave you twenty dollars for these three items and the deer stand? Oh no, not twenty. Oh yeah. No, no, yeah. no, 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 no. no. <laughs> Well, that took care of that. Yeah, I guess it did. <laughs> okay, would you take 
Five a piece for these three items then? Yes. Fifteen total for yes. all three? Yes, and that's a bargain. Okay. <laughs> I think I got a uh, power yeah, cord at home either. that'll fit. A what? A power cord for the CD player at home, I think I do. Oh, I didn't think about that. I probably do have one. Right now, I don't know where it's at. You said 15? Yes, ma'am. Like, I'm well, supposed to tell me. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, ma'am. Well, as luck would have it. There was another garage sale on my way home. So let's go check it out. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Great. How are you doing? Well, someone's here. <laughs> I was about to say, y'all are kind of far back here. Have you had a lot of foot traffic? Uh, well, Just we had it yesterday and today. Oh, okay. That's right. So y'all did have some good um, traffic, I guess? Okay. It was slow. Right? It was so cold in the morning. It got nicer in the day. But it, we... We have a little bit of traffic coming mm -hmm. through. Is today half price day then? Well, it could be uh, on certain things. <laughs> okay. Okay. What are you asking for this equipment right here? Well, um, let me call my husband because he's out on a walk right now. Okay. My husband said, how about 30? Uh, I was going to go around the 10 to $15 mark. Okay. Um, these facial pads over here, $2 a piece. Yeah. I think I'll take those from you. And then these shoes. Could we do an even 15? Uh, $2 a piece. Okay, well, yeah. well, plus the shoes for five, and these were 12 so okay. yeah, that'd be a $2 discount. Fair. Yeah, that's fair. Yeah, yeah that, that's fine. Here, look at this. Shoe station with a pair of shoes. <laughs> there you okay. go. That'll work. I got a five and a 20. Okay. That's fine. Thank you, ma'am. Okay. Uh -huh. Appreciate it. These yard sales have been pretty lame today. That the Olympus camera was the best thing I found all day. Just that one item. So we're gonna go into this Goodwill and see if we can't redeem ourselves and make it feel like it was better worth our time to go and get up and out of the bed this morning on this cold morning. Okay, these Shimano bicycling shoes can be worth some good money. Um, they look to be in good shape. I'm gonna do a bin test. They only want $5 for them and they're a rather small size but they're in european sizes um size 40. so yeah they look pretty good and they're holding up pretty well let's look up this model real quick and see what it looks like all right so there's 14 listed and four sold we got 40 22 50 and 53 so for five dollars i'll go ahead and pick these up too all right now we're talking a panasonic blue line vcr that is gonna be something worth picking up for the right price there's a zenith i'll look it up just because it's on top but normally i wouldn't but let's look up this panasonic and uh, see what price they want so this is a panasonic pvq v200 and it's looking pretty good we got 40 free ship or 35 plus ship both of them have no remote here's 35 plus ship no remote so they only want six dollars that's coming home with me and the zenith only wants six dollars that ended up not being too bad either that was somewhere around the 30 to 40 dollar mark with no remote too so looking good looking good on both these 
All right, so I wrote off the clothes a long time ago, but I'm starting to have to get back into it because, to be honest with you, they're shipping so much of my regular hard goods to shopgoogle.com. This uh, Columbia PFG Super Bahama is in really good shape and condition. It'll, they want 440, it's worth about 20 to 25 free shipping. And then this Patagonia Organic Cotton Polo is a nice one. It is also 440 and they will sell for about 20 to 25 free shipping. Luckily, there's no stains or anything on any of these. I don't think, I might've just found one right here. But uh, I still think that's worth picking up. Patagonia will sell even with that minor stain that I barely saw. Well, that actually ended up being pretty decent stop. Adding it all up, I spent $30.18 in that store, and I bought something you didn't see on tape. It's a DVD set of the Insanity Workout Program, the Beachbody Workout Program. Now, those can sell on eBay, but you run the risk of being b road That means that it's a copywritten type uh, product, and that the company who makes it will basically turn you into eBay, and, and you'll get suspended for a little while. So I'm going to sell that on Mercari, which I don't know. I've never heard of being b road on Mercari, but it'll be worth about 20 bucks. I only spent fifty on it. In all, the things I picked up there will get me about 140 bucks conservatively, and considering I only spent 30, 140 is almost four, is over four times on my money, so that makes me happy. So let's head on home and let's try to add everything up at once. It's Sunday, November 21st, the next day, and I've got everything lined up right here on my table. I hope you've held out this long to this video because I am surprised with the profit I'm going to make off these items. The yard sale started out pretty slow, but it ended up making me some big profit. Here we go. So here's everything I ended up picking up, whether it be at a yard sale or at Goodwill. And we're, let's start with this Columbia jacket. I paid $5. It'll sell for hopefully around $20 to $25. I got this guy game hide game hide hunting vest it was five dollars and it'll probably fetch me about 25 to 30 dollars this sony cd player cfd s2200 did indeed work i had a power cord just like i hoped i would it plays the cds it plays the tapes it plays the radio it's going for 40 to 50 dollars i paid five dollars for it this Zenith VCR paid $6, and as I said before, it'll go for around $30 plus shipping. This Panasonic VCR, I also paid $6, and it'll go for about $30 plus shipping. Sadly, this VCR did not work, and I had to return it for store credit. This Kodak camera paid $3, not such a big hitter, maybe $15. Bucks. This Insanity DVD workout set, I paid $2, and it'll go for about $15 plus shipping. These Buff Puff body sponges alone are only worth about six, seven, maybe eight dollars. I paid ten dollars for all six of them, and I'm gonna lot them up and sell them for around thirty to thirty-five dollars. This Columbia PFG Super Bahama XL shirt, I paid four fifty. It'll go for twenty dollars. This Patagonia Polo men's size large, I paid four fifty. It'll go for around twenty dollars. This is the Office Trivia Game. I paid $5 just to keep the relationship alive. Maybe I'll get $15 plus shipping. These Olakai shoes are pretty nice. The style name, it'll be hard for me to pronounce, but it looks like Nohia Moku. They were $5, and they're going to go for somewhere between $30 to $40. These Shimano... Shimano cycling or bike riding shoes MD76 is the model number paid five dollars and they'll go for 25 to 30 dollars this is that Phillips I didn't buy this to, to sell unfortunately I broke it as soon as I was putting it on the table to show it all off it fell off hit the corner and this busted right off this was for me to keep to clean VCRs like this but it broke. I'll use the conditioner that came in it with the current existing VHS cleaner uh, tape that I already have, but that is trash. This is the win of the day. This is what gets you to wake up and keep doing it the next time. Paid $5 for this Olympi Olympus Infinity Zoom 105 camera. And 
there's a sold listing for 130 others sold for around 80 or even 95 dollars this is your home run i've turned it on it does turn on for a short amount of time the battery in it has very little power but enough to say that it does power up good deal there and that's the winner of the day so let's go over the numbers real quick i ended up spending 71 dollars at all the yard sales in the goodwill conservative estimate is somewhere around four hundred dollars in profit so if you take away the 70 from the 400 that leaves me with about 330 dollars take away 13 percent and you got somewhere around 290 to 295 dollars not bad not bad at all of course you got to take out the taxes and all that good stuff but i'll let you and your cpa discuss that later well, that's it. Thanks for hanging out with me at Body Pal Picking. I'm so glad that you did. I had fun time yard selling and creating this video for you. If you're not subscribed, I really hope you choose to do so and give me a thumbs up because I really enjoy making these videos for you. Leave me some questions or comments down below and I'll make sure to answer them. Y'all stay safe out there and have fun picking.